Anne Romney attended Marquette University on September 20th, holding a Women for Romney campaign on behalf of her husband, presidential candidate Mitt Romney, helping to build awareness for the importance of women in this year's election. She was joined by some of Wisconsin's top women involved in government, including Lieutenant Governor Rebecca Cleefish, Senators Alberta Darling and Leah Vukmir, Paul Ryan's sister-in-law, Oakley Ryan, and Marquette student Sam Zager, who addressed a student perspective on the upcoming elections. Our generation is coming of age in an America that is less prosperous and less secure than it was four years ago. Half of today's college graduates can't find a job to match their skills, and only half of recent college graduates have full-time jobs. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome First Lady of Wisconsin and the next First Lady of the United States of America, Anne Romney. College Republicans from across the state were also out in full force looking to support the Romney-Paul campaign. I thought she did a great job. Um, I think it really got our campus riled up for the election. They got to hear her speak. They got to hear her talk about Mitt's personal life, which is something we don't often hear about. So it gave another side to Mitt. We got to meet Ann Romney on our campus, so it was all really exciting. Great news for Marquette. I think students are really excited after something like this. I mean, particularly the women that were in the audience, a lot of the message was, was geared toward females. I think it's so great for female college students to get to hear all the wonderful things that are going to be happening if Mitt Romney were to be elected. Anne Romney is spectacular. It's the second time I've actually seen her speak, and every single time she just gets me so fired up to do like more work for the campaign. I'm so excited I got to see her again. She's really inspiring. 